Some nice clear skies overhead, so you don't need your cheese salts ready just <laughs> yet. But uh, we know that time of year is right around the corner. Good morning, everyone. That clear sky trend, though, starting to shake up. Of course, yesterday we had a beautiful bluebird day. Now we have more clouds building in. So to the north, already pretty overcast towards the Twin Cities. Those clouds continuing to push south, so we'll have a partly sunny start to the day and then some overcast time later this afternoon. Lower 80s for highs, a very summery trend expected this afternoon. Gets cooler on Saturday. Feels a little more like October. And we do have the slight chance for an isolated shower later Saturday evening. Another front comes through on Sunday and brings some more isolated showers. And some really breezy conditions on Sunday. This is a look ahead to Sunday afternoon. We are going to see our wind speeds pick up in the afternoon with gusts close to 30 miles per hour. Monday, we're talking about morning frost and a lingering isolated shower possible. So let's talk about those wind speeds. This morning, things staying pretty quiet at about 5 to 10, but planning on our wind speeds really picking up later this afternoon, more 15 to 20, with wind gusts close to 20 to 25 possible. That's for today with our first front passing, planning on winds picking up again as we head into a Sunday. So a little closer look here, the timing with those clouds building in. We're clear along the state line at sunrise, partly sunny skies through the morning, a little overcast at times this afternoon, and then we'll be partly cloudy overnight. Tomorrow, plan on a partly sunny Saturday with that slight chance for an isolated shower popping up late in the day as our next cold front comes in. That's going to be the front that cools us down for Sunday. Speaking of temperatures, this morning we're at a pretty comfortable spot, 52 for Mineral Point, 60 near Middleton and Verona, Monroe at about 55. High temperatures today will climb up to a very summery spot. Low 80s, increasing clouds through the day. Tonight, partly cloudy with our overnight lows dropping to the upper 40s. So I'm not concerned about frost or any sort of deep freeze tonight or Saturday night. But Sunday night, more widespread frost possible. And we could be looking at a uh, freeze Monday night into Tuesday morning. Beyond that, another warming trend expected. And we can kind of see that towards the end of the extended forecast. Those temperatures expected to push back up the end of next week, climbing back above average.